Welcome back. You know, today is a day for everyone to be a top level, top secret British agent like 007. It's National Martini Day. And whether yours is shaken or stirred, there's always a fresh new twist on this classic cocktail. And for that, we turn to Matt Argenti from Escape Grace Distillery. Hey, Matt, how are you? Very well, how are you doing? And happy National Martini Day. Thank you very much. You've got this Scape Grace Black Gin. First off, let me tell you, the bottling, amazing. I love the shape oh, of this Oh, thank bottle. you. I mean, that looks really sharp. It looked good at my house. So tell us about this gin. Thank you so much. It's, uh, it's a nod to uh, the classic Geneva bottle. So, you know, we, uh, we love gin and uh, we have something new and exciting for you. So. Uh, today we're going to be talking about Scape Grace Black, and it's actually the world's first all-natural black gin. And the way that we make it black is actually we have five botanicals that represent a specific color and flavor. So we use aronia berries, which are red, butterfly pea, which is blue. You have uh, sweet potato, purple, saffron, orange, and pineapple yellow. And when you blend those colors together, it creates this beautiful black hue color. And um, it's absolutely delicious. There's nothing artificial. There's no charcoal. There was no coloring. It's all natural. And I think that's really special. That's exactly All right. So today we actually have something really exciting for you to, to feature uh, for you today. So we have three cocktails that are going to take you from the evening to the late hours all the way into the morning. So to kind of kick it off, um, we're going to do um, a classic black dry martini. So first thing you want to do, you want to make sure that all your martini glasses here are all chilled got to have a nice, good chilled cocktail. It's really important. So what you do, just kind of put ice, put some water in there, kind of drain it out. Right? So for this first one, we're going to do two and a half ounces of Scape Grace Black. And then we're going to do a half ounce of dry vermouth. And then, you know what, kind of kick it up a little bit enough. We're going to do a little couple dashes of orange bitters. All right, what you want to do then, pop your shaker on, give it a good shake, get a little good dance kind of going in there, have a little bit of fun. I think you just answered the question, Matt. Shake, not steer. Got it. Oh, shaking is always even better. <laughs> just like James So you Bond pop the say. shaker off, and then what you do, grab your strainer, and what you want to do is then now pour it into uh, this beautiful uh, Nick and Nora glass. Now, Everyone is very familiar with the uh, uh, traditional martini glasses that look like the triangle, but to be kind of abnormal and do it nice and different, uh, Nick and Nora glasses are very beautiful. So uh, what you want to do here for a nice garnish, grab your lemon peel, do a nice little slice here right in the dead center, give it a little fold, and then put it right here on the edge, and then here. You got a beautiful, oh, delicious man. black martini. That's what I love the most about dry martinis, it's a good aperitif. It kind of, it's good uh, before um, before we have dinner. It kind of gets the appetite going. It's really delicious. All right, but then after dinner, well, you know what? We're gonna have to have a good cocktail to kind of keep it going. So, with that being said, our next one is gonna be an espresso martini. Now. I'm sure most people are very familiar that it's always made with vodka, right. but we're gonna switch it up today and use black, all right? So pour out our pour out ice, and then here we're gonna do an ounce and a half of Scape Grace Black. We're gonna do uh, one ounce of premium coffee liqueur. We're going to do uh, one ounce of fresh espresso. Fresh is always the best. And then to kind of give it a little bit of a sweet touch, a half ounce of vanilla syrup. Okay. Then from there, pop your shaker back on. And by this time, I'm sure the cocktails are going. You're getting your dancing going now. We're having fun. Okay. I'll dance with you. All right. And then we'll pop it off. Grab our strainer. Coffee and, and gin. And then you're going to have a, be a beautiful espresso martini wow. oh look at that it's absolutely <clears throat> gorgeous now for a garnish what i would love to do just grab three of your coffee beans pop them right on top okay and there you go wow a beautiful gin espresso I martini i don't think i've ever had a coffee and gin cocktail before that look that's that's intriguing all right what's what's absolutely gonna round this out delicious. what's gonna round this out to get us all, all the right way through? so now listen you had a really great night the espresso martinis are going but you know what, if you're like me and my friends, you know, you had a really great Saturday night, 
you know what? You're going to have a really better Sunday morning. So a good brunch cocktail is what we call our breakfast martini. So this one is going to be a little bit different. We're going to be using our Skate Grace Classic. Now, which one is really special about this? This is a traditional London dry gin. We bring it to life with glacier water from the Southern Alps, 12 botanicals with a little bit of a lemon citrus forward. So what we do with this one, we'll take our chilled glass here, and then we do two ounces of Scape Grace Classic. Okay. And then we do a half ounce of triple sec, a half ounce a fresh lemon juice, and to give it a nice little touch, give it a nice teaspoon of orange marmalade. Oh, okay. Yeah. Very citrusy. Oh yeah, it's gonna be nice and delicious. It's perfect right for the morning. All oh, right, wait, again. Wait, go ahead, while you're shaking it up, I got a question for you You're though. having a good time. You're feeling it from last <laughs> night, but you know what, we're gonna make it a good morning. You're right. dancing at brunch too? Amazing. Oh, I'm dancing all the time. <laughs> Question for you. For those, I mean, you're making these great gin drinks. Love these. Does Scape Grace Distillery, see, I'm a vodka martini guy. Do you, does, okay. does, does Scape Grace Distillery sell vodka as well? We do, but not here in the U.S. It is actually out in um, New Zealand and in Australia. Okay. But you know what? It will be soon, hopefully, coming into the U.S. Can't wait, so this looks we'll really be coming good. out with a vodka very, very soon. Love it. But these gin drinks, yeah. obviously, the classic martini started with a gin. Fin finish that cocktail up for us, Matt. Oh, yeah. I got you. Don't worry. I got you. It's <laughs> National Martini Day. So, all right. So this one here is our breakfast martini. All right. Nice. Uh, lemon, orange, citrus, very delicious. And what you want to do for a garnish, get a nice little orange peel, put that in the side right there, and there you go. Wow. Cheers. Three fantastic yeah. cocktail recipes, all great martinis, all with Scape Grace Black, this gin. If you're looking for yes. something unique, something different, this could be the bottle. Where can people find this? You said the vodka is not available here, but obviously the gin is. Yes, we're actually here in Michigan, so uh, you can just find us in any of your local retail outlets, or if it's really important, go to scapegracedistillery.com, and you can purchase right directly from our website. Perfect. Thank you for the time, Matt. Appreciate it.